Hello babies, welcome to Diaper Diaries, original short stories with Mommy Lisa. Please like, subscribe, and click the notification bell so you will know when new stories are uploaded. Find links below to my Twitter, ABDO goodies in my eBay store, and to buy me a coffee. Donations are always very much appreciated. This Diaper Diary is Episode 8, titled Mommy Karen Nurtures Adult Baby Sam. Now enjoy the story. It was a beautiful day in the nursery. The sun was shining through the window, casting a warm glow over the room. The walls were decorated with posters of cartoon characters. In the center of the room sat a large crib, surrounded by shelves full of toys and stuffed animals. There was a bookshelf in the corner with books on two of the shelves and diapers lined the other two. Lying in the crib with a colorful mobile overhead was a middle-aged woman named Samantha. She had always loved the feeling of being taken care of, and she had embraced the lifestyle of an adult baby. She was dressed in a pink onesie and a matching bib, and she was sucking on a pacifier. As she lay there, Samantha heard a soft knock at the door. She looked up to see her caregiver, Mommy Karen, entering the room. Mommy was a young woman with a kind smile and gentle demeanor. She was dressed in a nurse's uniform, complete with a cap and white stockings. Good morning, baby Sam, Mommy said, walking over to the crib. How did you sleep? Sam smiled around her pacifier and gurgled in response. Mommy chuckled and sat her up, and then lifted onto her knees in the crib. Sam sat up on her knees and hugged Mommy while being cradled in her arms like a baby. She felt safe and secure, wrapped in Mommy's embrace. Let's get you changed, Mommy said, helping Sam over to the changing pad, set up on a cot at the edge of the room. She laid her down on the soft mat and began to undo the snaps on her onesie. Sam cooed and kicked her feet as Mommy changed her diaper. She loved the feeling of being pampered and taken care of. It was like she didn't have a care in the world. Mommy doused baby powder on her bottom and wrapped her snug into a fresh diaper. Once Mommy had finished changing her, she guided uh, Sam by the hand and sat her down in a high chair. She clipped a bib around her neck and poured a bottle of warm milk. Sam eagerly took the bottle and began to suckle. She felt a warm, comforting feeling spreading throughout her body. It was like all her worries and stresses were melting away, leaving her with nothing but contentment. Mommy picked up the bowl of mashed bananas and fed them to Sam, little spoonfuls at a time until it was all gone. Then she let Sam finish her bottle all by herself like a big girl. As she drank her bottle, Sam watched as Mommy began to play with some of the toys on the shelves. She picked up a stuffed teddy bear and began to make it dance around. Sam giggled around her bottle, enjoying the silly game. After a while, Mommy came over to the high chair and unclipped the bib. She wiped Sam's face with a warm washcloth and helped her out of the chair. Let's go for a walk outside, Mommy said, leading Sam over to the door. It's such a beautiful day. Sam smiled and snuggled into Mommy's arms as they walked outside. The sun was warm on her face, and the breeze felt refreshing against her skin. She looked around at the trees and flowers, feeling a sense of wonder and amazement. As they walked, Mommy began to sing a soft lullaby. Sam felt her eyes growing heavy as she nudged Mommy's direction to the blanket laid out on the back lawn. She felt safe and loved, surrounded by the beauty of the world around her. They sat on the blanket for a little while, enjoying the wonderful day. Eventually, Mommy walked Sam back inside and laid her down in the crib. She tucked her in with a soft blanket and gave her a kiss on the forehead. Sleep well, little one, she whispered before leaving the room. Sam closed her eyes and drifted off to sleep. She dreamed of teddy bears and rainbows, of warm milk and soft blankets. It was a dream world of peace and happiness where she was loved and cared for and no one criticized her for her lifestyle. As she slept, Sam knew that she had found her place in the world. She was an adult baby and she was proud of it. She didn't need to be anyone else 
or do anything else. All she needed was the love and care of those around her and the knowledge that she was living exactly the way she wanted to. The End I hope you enjoyed this episode of Diaper Diaries. Please like, subscribe, and click the bell notification so you will be notified. And also don't forget to visit the links below. I'll see you again soon, my babies.